Adidas, the mentor of the Quetta Gladiators, and probably the greatest player of all time, Sir Vivian Richards. Uh, sir, we were talking about the last match we had against Lahore Kalandas, when we had a target of 201, and when the players came back to the dressing room, you said, belief, belief is the key, boys. So, what was the thinking behind it? Because you said just one word to motivate the players. Well, to be fair, uh, whenever you're competing, uh, I guess um, there are times you're going to have doubts. And um, for some reason last night, especially the total that was mounted, it, it looks like it was going to be a, a difficult total to, to, to overcome. But um, they've done it to us, so why can't we do it to them? And uh, These are some of the things that you try and tell or, or you try and get over to the individuals that you are part of, especially the Equator Gladiators. It's just belief that um, all things are possible because you never know what's around the corner. If you do not um, compete or you do not believe, you'll never ever find out what you're capable of. So the connection between you and the Quetta Gladiators family is very, very oh. strong. The most animated person uh, on, on the dugout or on the team bus is you. What pushes you to be so animated and to be so close to the team? Well, to be fair, I've been part of um, the Big Bash. Uh, I've been part of uh, the IPL. Uh, I've never felt as comfortable as I um, as I did with with um, the Quetta Gladiators. You know, it's uh, especially from meeting the owner, Mr. Nadim, uh, all the, the folks you know who are attached to the Quetta Gladiators themselves. You know, everyone made me feel very very comfortable. And if you are in a com comfortable environment, certainly going to express yourself and that is what I'm doing because I'm very comfortable in the Queen of Gladiators family. It is very important to tell that sir does not sit around with the star players but he sits with the newcomers and the emerging players. Sir, what is the concept or the theory behind sitting with the emerging players and motivating them instead of going to the stars because when you see different teams, uh, the mentors or the coaches run around the top players but as far as you are concerned, you are not much engaged with the top players but the emerging players and you like to give time to them. Well, when you have someone like KP, you know, who I think um, is a very special person when it comes to uh, batsmanship, he, he doesn't need any sort of a, a motivation uh, or motivating to, to that degree. And it's all about maybe the younger players. You know, KP has been there, he has done it, and basically he has almost achieved everything in the game. So uh, this is not the folks that you target because you know that uh, he needs no, no, no sort of motivation. It's himself because of what he brings, the talent and uh, all the stuff, uh, the competitive nature which, uh, which he uh, exudes. So it's about maybe the young individuals who haven't quite been in that category for them to, to for you to, 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 to let them maybe have a look at him, all the other experienced players, the Luke Wrights, you know, the, the Riley, uh, Russo and all the other top guys, uh, Milzy, all those guys, you know, who are in the team itself, all those guys have played international cricket and to be fair, uh, you can only wish them the very best because you know, they know exactly what it takes to compete and some of the younger players from Pakistan haven't been quite in that category. So it's all about getting them and lifting them to get to that standard. Sir, if I can recall sir, what you said last time around, you were quite confident that Sarfraz will be the skipper of Pakistan and as far as Mohammad Nawaz is concerned, very initially in the inaugural with PSL you said he will going to be the star of PSL. Uh, what do you uh, what do you will say about our emerging player Hassan Khan because he has pro produced some quite good performances against the top legs? Oh, I was pretty impressed, you know, uh, especially uh up against some of the, the best players and in the world and just the way in which he evolved, the way he, he would have handled himself in the field, the commitment and at 18, you know, he is basically performing like a mature sort of individual and that I think can, can only serve the creator gladiators in the future, having such young individual who I guess in his first year, the experience gained here, he'll be much better in the future. So before we let you go, can you just for the for one once will say the word belief that you said in the same manner in the dressing room? Well, to to be fair, uh, 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 and, uh, ho and I hope and I hope you come along with me yeah. with this sense. Believe. believe. <laughs>